everyone welcome back to my channel I just want to talk about a couple of things but the most important thing I wanted to talk about is always beauty related and cosmetics so this is what it's going to be about the lipsticks I've been wearing a lot very very recently and I just wanted to share it with you one of them I mentioned in the past both of them I mentioned it is the one from Cicely Paris Whenever I wear white, which I own a lot more white clothing for the summer season, I love wearing this lipstick. It is shade number 22. Um, you have seen it on my lips. I love it because the attention is more drawn to my lips than my eyes. And basically, I'll have nothing on my eyes, including mascara, just my sunglasses, and usually on a very, very hot, humid day. But since I'm wearing more of an eye makeup, um, I like to wear this one which is MAC limited edition you can't get it anymore and it's called Barbie style and this is the same shade as Barbie's lipstick color so I really love this I've got it on right now very neutral flattering cool pink cool tone and I'm really loving this and I just wanted to share that with you but what I really wanted to talk to you about is this it is about my pen mon blanc i don't write as much as i used to i don't have to obviously because we have computers and um sometimes it's good to own one very good decent decent pen uh to do some journal writing or that kind of thing or just have it handy by your telephone and what i really love about this is a few things this was given to me as a gift from a co-worker many many years ago um, I was struggling with a lot of hand pain back then because I had to write a lot at work and it was more like um, writing down everything that was being said kind of thing and your hand would be throbbing and it would hurt very very much I don't want to mention the type of job that I had. Maybe after I retired, I'm open and more willing to talk about my past job experiences and share them with you because they're quite interesting. It's sort of like um, those other YouTubers who started a channel based on uh, my experiences during jail time and then they're giving you tons of stories or my experience as a porn movie kind of thing i'm just thinking of a couple of youtubers that i came by and i thought they were kind of interesting and then also with their experiences it life experience to share with other people so you can learn through other people's experiences and not make the same error that kind of thing but anyways um i got this as as a gift uh, from a co-worker many years ago. I haven't seen him in many years also and um, He suggested this he had one of his own I think it was a calligraphy style and I know how to write in calligraphy and Yeah, it um, I it was suggested I should start making uh, Cards with calligraphy handwriting, but I just didn't want to do that uh, just the time and always working with my hands I didn't think I could handle that much with working with my hands. So I give a lot of credit to hairdressers using their scissors and cutting all the time in the same movement kind of thing. But it must be very, very difficult. Anyways, this is a Mong Bong pen. I got this back then for, I think it was 200 back then or maybe 300. And, uh, 200 I think or 250. It was quite a lot of money back then, especially at that age, but it was a great investment. And I've had it all these years. It, it writes very smoothly. Um, this is what it looks like. I highly recommend it, a great investment. Some people um, are dead set. I'm only getting a big pen and that's it. Why would you waste your money on something like that? You know what, I've had this for I had to think about it almost 30 years so is it 30 well 20 years for sure 20 years but 
Oh gosh, I don't want to remember my age. But yeah, I highly recommend these. You can never go wrong. If you want to give a gift to someone who just graduated from high school, get one of these. It will last forever. This is great value. It lasts a long time. The refill um, is at the top. You just unscrew it and all you have to do is buy the refill typically at a jewelry store and that's what it looks like in some Mont Blanc ink and I have it in medium blue I really like this I really like this it's made in Germany and with this pen it has its typical symbol at the very top the little star and they're actually uh, starting to sell jewelry it's been out for a few years so that to me was something new and I think it's a beautiful pen there it glides across the paper easily there's no ache you don't have to press hard it's amazing so I think it's a really good thing and I just wanted to share this with you so take care and thank you for joining me on my channel. Bye.